Dear friends and writers, I'd like to speak about God. I was a and mutton busted. I was at the uh, Norfolk Rodeo uh, to see a mutton busted show. They got these little kids on mutton. And there's a little girl there that beat most of the boys' courage. Look at this little, look at the Peter Hackle boy. Okay. And look at this little guy here. Cute stuff. I wish I could put this on the line. But uh, this one wasn't so lucky. Uh, but I would say that these little kids here really earned the right to be a cowboy. On my field, of course. Cute um, stuff, huh? Norfolk is a very, very cool town in the Riverside County. I was personally ashamed to be a cowboy and to wear a cowboy hat because these little six-year-olds deserved the hat more than I did. It was my first rodeo. Mr. Stone, you are a scientist, PhD pharmacology university professor, at least for six months. You can spell words I can't even pronounce. You should be proud of your scientific knowledge. Why did you use science? as the main campaign team. You know science is the backbone of a modern society. Likewise, you should also be proud of your Jewish heritage. You, sh well, you prefer to wear cowboy outfits and shoot 357 magnets. You're a string of 10, no, not 10, 11 immaculate creatures. Creature shell at this podium is it's shameful. It's hypocritical to go around preaching God, guns, and country when instead you should be promoting science. Something that you know something about. You are no cowboy, Mr. Stone. You instinctively know that being a cowboy will help you win elections. You are willing to deny your scientific training because your political flair tells you you cannot win an election as a scientist. You have full knowledge of what goes on at the science policy compound in Tennessee. But you won't do anything about it. You accept political contributions from the so-called church. In case we have not made it clear in the 130 addresses we've had here, Scientology is essentially a spy and mind control network set up to extract the most money it can from its members, as well as to enforce the maximum amount of production from each individual, employees, I should say, at or no cost to the organization. That's from ex scientologist Mr. John Peter. Why do you support them so much? Besides that political contribution, I think it's because you think going after the churches, further crimes may ruin your temecula church support. They refuse to sum up your three I'm done. Uh, I encourage everybody not to let Kim and Chris go vote. Thank you. Thank you. The vice president of the uh, yeah. vote, we're very generous. 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 We're very